actually, I, I, I think I, I contributed to uh, create the concept of home studio a long time ago when I was uh, even at the, uh, a student at the Music Research Center in Paris studying electronic music. It was in days where studios were big recording studios and we were not able to uh, have even access to those kind of studios, professional studios. So I, I started really with few synthesizers and few, uh, few instruments really at home and, and I created a kind of home studio in, in days it was not that fashionable, that trendy. And, uh, and then I, I kept this idea of considering the studio as a kind of atelier, like a painter or a writer, where first, first of all, before everything else, I, I like to be on my own and, and, uh, and uh, using technology as a, as a part of the um, uh, creative process. I'm uh, really uh, absolutely convinced that the future is a, is a perfect match between anal analog and digital. And uh, more than ever, it's what I'm doing in, in this world too at the moment by mixing really uh, analog synthesizer, analog stuff, part of the mythology or legend of electronic music in general, but mixed with the most uh, up-to-date date, uh, digital uh, way of recording. So I think the, the I mean, Every, each world has, uh, has advantages and, and, uh, and weaknesses. And uh, I'm, uh, so I, I like when, if I'm using uh, analog, pure analog, analog stuff to use digital uh, converters or things like that because it, it just, it's just a, a complementary uh, uh, com technique which enriches um, on a harmonic point of view, the, the sound more than it's uh, uh, in, in. Okay, in other words, let's put it a different way. If, if, you're, if I'm using a, a digital synthesizer, I like using analog preamps, for instance. But if I'm using analog synthesizers, I, li I like digital converters. I mean, but you know, this is my way of working. It doesn't mean that it's better or worse than anybody else. I mean, by the end of the day, what's great, which great uh, today is, you can use the technology. Whatever technology you, you use, I mean, depending on the project you're involved with. You see what I mean? Uh, sensual, organic way. I mean, they are like, uh, I have a very, um, I would say, emotional relationship with uh, instruments. I think th this is the basics of, uh, of music. If you take a, a violin player or, or, or guitar player, he has a kind of uh, almost sexual relationship with his instrument. The same with uh, with with, uh, with a desk or, or with headphones or or, or with uh, uh, digital or, or analog gear. I like, I'm using headphones more than uh, I think uh, lots of uh, people. I, for instance, I, I've, um, I like to mix with headphones, which is not that um, uh, obvious, but I like going from uh, the normal conditions of mixing with uh, speakers and, and checking with, uh, uh, with uh, headphones. And I'm, I must say that uh, I'm, I'm, I'm most of the time I'm using Sennheiser, Sennheiser uh, um, headphones for, for studios. Actually I'm using more Sennheiser for, for mixing than for listening uh, to music at home. On a pure professional way, I don't know if I should say that, I should say that but I, mm -hmm. I tell the truth. I mean I think that uh, uh, this, for me the Sennheiser, okay, the Sennheiser, the Sennheiser are, 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 really, um, are really very precise and they are amongst very few uh, headphones to give you the uh, uh, the sense of space and sense of room and not having the sound directly stuck on your on your on, on your head when i'm listening to music in normal conditions i like to be placed in a kind of average situation where any anybody else can listen to the music because by the end of the day if you are listening to your music with headphones too, uh, too good or too professionals. I mean, it creates a gap with the, the audience. So I like to, to try lots of different, uh, different headphones. But I, I like using um, uh, headphones. And these days, you know, where, where uh, you know, the idea of, um, of hi-fi 
uh, hi-fi system has disappeared. I mean, a few years ago, uh, everybody had uh, hi-fi systems. And now people are, are listening to music on small uh, plastic speakers. And then there are more music is becoming nomadic in, and you can carry your, your, your music in, in the pocket. Less, it, it's so strange, but people are less and less uh, um, interested or involved in the way the sound has to be, uh, to be uh, uh, received in, in a domestic uh, use. So headphones are, are, um, headphones bec are becoming a very important way of, um, of um, receiving and enjoying music these days. And it's the reason why that it's, it has, to, as a musician, as a creator, you have to, to be very careful and to be conscious of the fact that the, your, your, your creation will be conveyed in the best, best possible way through uh, headphones. And I would say, whichever they are. Thank you very much. You're more than welcome. <laughs> Thank you.